Hello guys, so a little bit of a different kind of video here. I just wanted to do a quick showcase of my latest conversion work. As you can see, it is Aragorn, Legolas and Gimli, Defenders of Helm's Deep Edition. So I'm just going to do a quick, brief analysis of how I put these together, nothing too crazy. So let's get right into it. Now once again, forgive my uh, relatively messy work table, but up first we have Gimli. Uh, probably the easiest and quickest of the conversions not much to say about this one i did a bit of an axe head swap uh swapped these two axes around as you can see there uh, and just placed him on top of a rock to simulate him leaping heroically off the deeping wall to save aragorn speaking of uh here he is aragorn uh inspired by the scene of him charging with the glathrim down to the uh Uruk-hai at the breach of the deeping wall uh, i really like this kind of much more at the ready charge pose. Um, so I took the original Helm's Deep Aragorn with the vertical sword, removed the sword and replaced it with <laughs> Glamdring, I think of all things. It was the only sword I had at hand, I'm afraid, but uh, looks close enough. And let, just laid that horizontally across his arm. Uh, and then I removed the left leg uh, about here and replaced it with three hunters Aragorn's leg, just kind of cocked to the side and put his back foot on a rock to kind of simulate that pre-charge pose. And finally, we of course have Legolas, uh, shield surfing down the stairs of the Deeping Wall. Couldn't resist this one, such an iconic moment, so I kind of had to give it a go. As for the base, um, it's chopped up bricks from this old Gondorian ruin set, uh, roughly fashioned into a uh, somewhat stair-shaped um, little diorama piece there, and then on top obviously we have the uruk shield. But as for Legolas himself, he's again comprised of two sculpts, the original Metal Helm's Deep version, where he's got that foot on the rock. As you can see this is where the rock would be, but I've chopped it off at the foot. Uh, I've also chopped him in half around the waistline to reposition his torso upwards a bit more. Then I just replaced the arms, this is Three Hunters Legolas because it's a really nice detailed bow. And then again, the arrow and the arm and the little hair piece here. Three hunters, leg lass. And finally, we have the cape, which is once again from the three hunters set. Then obviously I've, I've filled everything in with green stuff, given him a Rohan sword and just positioned it nicely at a bit of an angle there. So yeah, that's my three hunters Helm's Deep Edition. Let me know what you guys think down below. Uh, obviously up next, no, Helm's Deep Force would be complete without some elven reinforcements.